Hello, I'm Dr. Donna Pletcha. I'm Director of Breast Imaging at University Hospitals, Cleveland Medical Center, associated with Case Medical School. And I'm here today working with Sectra to go through a few cases of um, breast imaging to look at the features of the Sectra PAX workstation. So in front of us we have a screening exam. On the left-hand side is the current exam with C-View images. CC and MLO views, and on the right-hand side we have prior images, and we have two years of priors for comparison. At this time we have a 2D image of a prior, and then we can click this um, tab and we can get all of the images from the more recent mammogram 2D image. We're also able to toggle in the old images to bring up C-views if we would like to compare C-view to C-view from prior images to current images. On this view, we're able to compare up close the 2D image from priors and the current C-view. We're able to quadrant through to look for calcifications and changes in calcifications. And I commonly will use that to look for calcifications and asymmetries that are smaller or harder to see. Again, I can go back um, in time or forward in time, and I can go back to C views, and I can go back to 2Ds. I can toggle to previous C views. So here I'm comparing C view current exam to C view of the prior exam. I can also toggle between the C views and the Tomo stack, and I'm able to scroll through the Tomo stack with the new find the same location and then scroll to the same location on the old Tomo image here with this larger, um, more coarse calcification in the retroareolar region. I can then toggle back to the 2Ds, and if I need to go back in time or forward in time, I can do that on the old images. This is an example of um, just the C views with the CC views of the current exam. Again, sometimes I will quadrant zoom through this on a 2D or C view looking for calcifications and then move forward to the MLO views and again quadrant zoom through that. Now if there's something that I see on the image that I'd like to call the patient back for, I'm able to circle an area or use an arrow function to point to an area and then common Additional views that I may ask for, I use the scrolling text, such as, let's say, a 90-degree Tomo, or in this case, if I wanted to call this back for spot magnification views for this area, I don't have to type the additional views in every time. I can just scroll through my texts and pick the one I want. At that time, when the patient comes back for her additional imaging or her um, diagnostic workup, our technologists don't have to talk to the radiologist on that day. They will just do the extra views that are marked on the films. The other really nice function of the sector workstation is our chat function. So we are able to use chat to talk to our technologists. If I come over here, I'm able to chat with one of our technologists if she needs to talk to me about a certain case and give me some background on that case or if she has a question about which additional views she can take or I can chat to the technologist to let them know that we need an ultrasound in this area. Um, I can send a link of these images to the technologist and all she has to do is open the chat window click on the link and that patient will open up with the marked and annotated images. So it's a good way to um, keep the technologists doing what they do best ex instead of coming back and standing behind me looking for um, what images they need to take or what the next steps are. I can chat them through the packs and they can spend less time walking back to the reading room and waiting for me um, if I'm being interrupted by other people or the phone or whatever, um, I can chat with them through um, the chat function. The other way we use the chat function, we have a um, big university hospital um, medical center with multiple uh, community sites and community hospitals. And if I need a second opinion on a case and I'm wondering if I should give calcifications a CAT3 or a CAT4 or I want to ask a colleague if they would call this case back or not, I'm able to chat 
um, my colleagues and link the exam through PACS and get second opinions that way. So it's a really nice way to keep the flow of the day going, um, but still being able to interact with both my colleagues and uh, the technologists that I'm working with that day. Once you get through the case, you can um, put your CAD on and toggle the CAD on and off your 2D images if you would like. At any time during the um, exam, you can toggle on and off with your CAD. One of the other functions that we use during the day if we are working closely with our surgeons and they have surgery clinic going on, we will do same day diagnostic reads and in order to let them know what our reading is um, live before we dictate the case, we will go into our comments section under properties and we will put in the category and our recommendations. And then the MAs or the um, nurse assistants that are working with the surgeon that day will let the surgeon know um, what our reading is. And so they don't have to come back and review every single case with us. They know exactly what um, the reading is and the MA doesn't have to come back. They can um, communicate or we can communicate with them through PACS so that they know exactly what the reading is on every single diagnostic case they are seeing that day. So I've showed you a lot of different tools and functions of the workstation that really helps with the flow of the day for breast imaging and mammography reading. We're able to have better workflow with our technologists and our technologists rarely will come back to the reading room wasting time waiting for us to tell them what extra views we need or what we're asking for from them. With the chat function, we're able to have the technologists spend most of their day in the room getting images as opposed to coming back to see us. We're also able to communicate with other colleagues to get second opinions no matter where they are in the system as long as they're signed into their PAC station. We also communicate with our surgery teams and our surgeons and let them know on a case by case basis during the day what the reading is on their diagnostic same day reads for the patient seeing them in clinic. So overall, Sector's workstation has made us more efficient and able to communicate with those we need to communicate with every day.